Your Difference is Your Strength, A Guide to Accepting Yourself for Anyone Who Has Ever Felt Out of Place, written and narrated by Chris Ferraro. For the last picked, perpetually dismissed, the overlooked, underseen, and everyone in between, every word of this is for you. Forward. Words by Tama Keeves. Maybe you felt different from others and wished you could fit in. But what if you could not only accept yourself exactly the way you are, but celebrate and amplify what makes you a singular powerhouse? You hold that ticket in your hands. I wish I'd read this book years ago. It might have spared me a thousand journal pages and a wad of therapy bills. Like many of us, I fought my difference. I tried desperately to do the right things, things others told me were rational and commendable, even when they made me feel like an imposter. I wasn't an obvious misfit. Actually, I could play normal pretty well. I graduated from Harvard Law School and pleased my New York City Jewish parents and school guidance counselors everywhere. I got a high-paying job on the partnership track of a big law firm. But all the while, I felt like this undercover oddball. Something was missing for me. Meaning, oxygen, and soul. Everyone said I had success, but... I felt like I had a picture of success, and the real me wasn't in that picture. It was only when I walked out of everything without a plan, got a job waiting tables, dated a long-haired tarot card reader, and started writing that I felt alive for the first time. Yep, I looked like a weirdo. I shocked my family. But I could breathe. I felt more alive than I'd ever felt in my life. And when I finally honored this true spirit within me, I wrote the books I needed to write and started teaching and coaching others. I even became a national expert on career transformation. I have helped thousands or tens of thousands of others to discover and live their callings. And I'm just one person who listened to the difference inside herself. Can you imagine the impact on this planet if we all honored what made us different? I think Chris Ferraro imagines this for us, and her bold, fun, brilliant book, Your Difference is Your Strength, is the permission you may have needed to be the most audacious. The world doesn't give you guideposts for how to turn your differences into the tools of a trailblazer, but Chris Ferraro does. In this book, you will find the healing of being acknowledged, seen, and encouraged. You'll find techniques that help you regain your power. She gives you movies to watch, soundtracks to listen to, and examples of other misfits who transformed into trailblazers and contributed to the lives of others. We live in a world that is changing. We are charged with embracing diversity because, as Chris Ferraro says, our difference is our strength. Think about the greatest innovations and movements in business, medicine, creativity, and politics. The best of what we are hasn't come from people who are trying to match the status quo. We move forward and sideways because of people who think and breathe and see things differently. It takes people who are different to help us to do things differently. I shared this in my book, Inspired and Unstoppable and I will share it here. Quote, As a creative, individual, visionary leader, independent thinker, soul healer, or entrepreneur, it's your birthright to utilize other talents, insights, resources, and innate strategies. You are not made to fit into the world, make it in the world, but to remake the world, heal the world, and illuminate new choices and sensibilities, obey your rebel brilliance, unquote. We are living in times with new challenges, but our new solutions will come from misfits, those who are alternatively gifted and original. 
Some of you may feel as though you're just trying to get by, never mind saving the world. Chris Ferraro is here to address you wherever you are and take you on a journey of bravery. You've got a great guide in Chris. She's so real. She's lovable. She's wise. And make no mistake, she is a force of nature. If you've ever hoped to have an ally, someone who really got you and stood up for you, you found her. She takes every ounce of her personal pain and alchemizes it into perspective, wisdom, and moxie for us all. Your differences, your strength needs to be shared, and this message needs to be sung from rooftops. I hope these words are read far and wide, and most of all, I hope that more of us begin to embody this message, because we are all misfits in some way. We have shied away from our big talents, instinctive leanings, or true voices at some point, and maybe this is the book that will help you stand strong in your one-of-a-kind gift to this planet self. I hope you do. And I'm so grateful that Chris Ferraro has risen in her power to sound the call. May we all find our own brilliant way. Tama Keeves is a USA Today featured visionary career coach and is the best selling author of Thriving Through Uncertainty and A Year Without Fear. Visit her at www.tamakeeves.com. Introduction. The square peg abandons the round hole. Quote, No one is you, and that is your greatest power. Unquote. Dave Grohl. I always just knew. There was never a before time, never a simple moment of forgetting, not ever a time when I just felt normal, whatever that is. As I grew through childhood into adolescence and later adulthood, there were the more obvious external signs. The unconventional body type, the commanding voice, all that wacky creativity, the mystical leanings where I talked to the universe, animals, and trees, that time in eighth grade when I had my hair cut into a crew cut with the tips of my naturally black hair dyed blonde, my attraction to music and movements outside the mainstream. Hi, let me introduce myself. I'm Chris, and I'm just different. I've gone by many labels, ones others have placed on me and ones I've recognized within myself. Loser, weirdo, freak, misfit, rebel, mystic, empath. And while on the outside I don't look like a success story or an inspiration, the truth is that in the uncovering of who I truly am, I've become the star of my own sweet world. I'm here not only to take the road less traveled, but also to blaze a brand new path forward into original realms. And that is something no mainstream winner person could ever do. I was born with a spiritual and creative calling that was beckoning me to stop searching for and trying to become worthy of the acceptance of them. My higher self knew that was never going to happen and that it could never provide what I longed for, to be understood, accepted, cherished, and loved. As early as grade school, I immersed myself in biographies, reveling in true tales of those. If I could figure out how they did it, then maybe I could do it. What I found shocked me. All those visionaries and creative geniuses, every single one of them had an origin story similar to mine. They weren't born into prestige and unwavering support. No one looked at them and said, you are destined to become someone. Their peers didn't shower them with adoration. No, not at all. They started out as misfits, just like me. They used their adversity and passion to become trailblazers. Decades in, I knew. The misfit and the trailblazer are two sides of the same archetype, sharing the same sacred destiny to advance life forward.